Hey guys, Brett Parker here, Handicapped Scratch. Today I've got something quite exciting for you. It's just turned up in the post today. My golf crate. So what this is, if you're unfamiliar, is a subscription box. Basically you pay a monthly fee, which can be cancelled at any time, and they randomly pack the boxes and send them out to your house every month. It's quite exciting. Now anyone that knows me will know I'm a little bit of a nerd out of the past. I'm a very bit of, bit of a techie and a bit of a gaming head. Uh, anyone will know if you can guess what this picture in the top left is here. I'll put a full screen picture on. Um, comment down below. I'll be quite interested to see if anyone knows what that picture is from. Um, but in the gaming industry, they do a box called Loot Crate, and it's very, very similar to this. Now, what it is, they randomly pack the boxes with things that are specific to that industry. So in the gaming industry, obviously, it's like T-shirts, collectibles, and stuff like that. And I'm suspecting that in the golf version, there's going to be golf balls, towels, training aids. I don't, I don't really know what to kind of expect. I'm quite excited for this. Uh, so let's have a look at what that website says. So it's um, $29.99 for a order, or $29.95, sorry, per month for an order. Uh, it includes four to six golf products, training aids, training drills. Each box focuses on certain aspects of your game while introducing you to new brands and products. Appropriate for all handicaps. So it's quite a bold statement. Um, Let's see if it's value for money. Let's see what we get in this. I'm really excited for this. Oh, I'm kind of excited for this. Okay, so first thing greeted with is kind of like a, almost a certificate sort of type of, type of thing. I don't really know how to describe it. Um, and kind of looks like it's sort of uh, listing out what you're gonna get in the box, although I don't want to pay too much attention to it. I want to leave the excitement for actually looking inside the box. Um, and then it also it would appear that you get a training aid in there and it kind of explains to you how to use the training aid. Right, let's open it. It's very well packaged. Okay, first thing I see is a Callaway Swing Easy Training Aid. But it stopped something else. <laughs> Some st a sticker on it. Um, I haven't used one of these before. It would appear like it's kind of trying to bring your elbows more topped in as opposed to chicken wings, so to try and keep you more controlled. Um, so Callaway Swing Easy Training Aid. Uh, next I can see is uh, Vice Golf Balls, um, Vice Tour Golf Balls Pack of Three. Uh, next, uh, Bees Tees, so some small, say par three, maybe if you're a, a, a driver hit that hits down the ball, smaller tees. Um, next, all weather, high quality, all weather golf glove. Now, all weathers, I believe the brand, if I'm not mistaken. Let's have a look. Now this would be quite interesting because I assume that when you order, you would have to tell them whether you're left or right-handed because it would be a bit annoying if I uh, arrived with a right-handed glove. Perfect, really nice, it's actually really nice quality. Not that I should be surprised, but um, yeah, it's actually really nice quality. Uh, so golf glove, moving on. Um, some more Vice golf balls, uh, Vice Drive. I'm really interested to try these. I recently got sent the Forte, Forte or Forty. I don't really know how you say it. I recently got sent the Forte golf balls. Um, so I want to put these against them um, and kind of see what the, the differences are. And then right at the bottom, you've kind of got like a grass hitting mat. I'm not sure whether that's just a part of the box or whether that's like some sort of training aid as such um, and then that's it inside the box uh, looking back go back to the card now that we know what's in it uh, on the back how to use your swing easy trainer so this is specifically this I will take a look at this and if I feel it's a of benefit to me and my game I will do a video on it um, and then on the back it kind of lists through everything that you get um, so golf weather glove, vice golf balls, a chipping mat, that's specifically what this is, it's not just something that's thrown in the bottom. Um, this isn't ordinary artificial gas, this is grass, sorry. Um, this is 20 millimeter toughened artificial grass made to endure golf thuds and dings. Keep this preserve in your garden, oh, keep this to preserve your garden and to use it in the lounge to chip balls into dog bowls. That's actually a really clever idea because everywhere downstairs in my house is laminated. So unfortunately the, the girlfriend, or the fiance, sorry, will not allow me to chip it off the floor, so that'll actually come in really handy. Tip, push four long tees into each corner of the ground to make the mat secure. So I'm guessing you can use this in the back garden and rather than taking divots out the grass, you can put that down. That's actually quite a handy tool now that I think about it. Uh, what else was in here? Uh, Callaway Swing Easy, which is this. The Vice Tour Golf Balls, which are obviously the golf balls. And then some more Vice Golf Balls as well. So what I'm really interested in with this is 
you have to pay twenty nine ninety five a month. Is there twenty nine ninety five in this box? I want to do a little bit of a test, so I'm going to go through, value all these products if I had to buy them individually, and then test were they worth the price. Okay, so I've calculated the value of all these products. I've uh, individually sourced them from different places. So, for example, the Go Glove was from Amazon. Uh, Callaway was from Amazon, uh, the Vice Golf Balls were from their website, then worked out exactly how much they do it for you, how much each ball costs you uh, for both of them, and then again, Amazon for the, throwing stuff around, BSTs. Um, the only one that I had slight difficulty with is obviously the chipping mat. Um, this is not a branded product that you can specifically buy, it looks like... Um, Kind of they bought a large sheet of it and then cut it up to suit the boxes. Um, so I've took an estimation on this. They can get a slightly bigger one um, in, in on Amazon and in American Golf for about thirty pounds. Conservatively between fifteen and twenty pounds. I've given it a twenty pound um, estimation based on the uh, the leaflet that we got. It's toughened artificial grass. It looks of decent quality. It's very very tough and it looks like it wouldn't ruin anything that you place it on. So uh, I've given that a twenty dollar price or a twenty pound price. Sorry. Um, and total, you pay twenty nine ninety five for the box per month in this month's subscription box, which is January twenty seventeen. You got a total value of forty eight pounds sixty one. So you've got you know not quite double what you uh, paid for, but you got a lot more than you could. I think all these products are applicable to everyone. So this everyone will use. Uh, I'm sure someone can find or well, everyone can find uh, a value of that. Everyone needs a golf club. Everyone definitely needs balls. Um, and the tees are obviously relevant as well, which I've managed to lose. Tees. <laughs> um, so all these products are very relevant. I'm kind of excited to see, uh, is this something that's going to take off in the UK? Is this something that you're interested in? If you like this video, give it a like. Um, comment down below, do you know what this picture is? Would do you try something like this? Um, the link for the company is in the description down below. Go and check them out on social media, Twitter, Facebook, um, and Instagram. I think they're on Facebook, I'm not 100% sure, but they're definitely on Twitter and Instagram. Um, check these out. Are you gonna pick something like this up? Are you gonna subscribe to this? What did you think of this unboxing for this month? And I'll see you in the next video. Um, like this video if you like it. Are you going to get a, a loot crate? Oh. Hand.